hello guys, this is your favorite celebrity info channel, Screen Trends. And today, we're going to get to the bottom of how Joro got exposed. But there is some insane info about it. So let's get into it. But first, are you subscribed yet? If you're not, why aren't you? Subscribe so that you always know when we're uploading a brand new video. Now, let's get into this. Jerob is one of the nicest TikTokers to exist. Jerob was extremely well known. However, Jerob has been quiet, and his main account has been inactive since February. Before February, he would post recordings calling individuals out for things that were not okay discussing important topics. For example, people of color rights and LGBTQ rights and women's rights, and many, many more things. Jerome started with TikTok in June 2019 and was amassed more than 5.7 million followers between his two currently deactivated accounts at Jerob and at Jerob B L I R L. He likewise seems to have deactivated his Twitter and Instagram accounts. Jerob was known on TikTok for getting down on others for bad behavior, which is very interesting considering what he did. Wait, what did he do, you ask? Well, let us let the person who was abused by Jerob explain himself. The victim who goes by Dylan said in the video that Jerob is one of the biggest hypocrites he met in his life. Dylan also said that Gerald is using his platform on TikTok to groom children. And Dylan even provided screenshots of Gerald doing this to him. The main thing Dylan said is, I didn't say anything for the past 8 months because I thought I was the only one until recently. I found out there were multiple people that Gerald was groomed. John does not deserve to have any type of platform because if he does, he will continue this behavior and will not stop preying on teenagers. He is a disgusting and terrible person. But what exactly did Jerob do to Dylan? It's pretty interesting, right? So, we're going to get into some more details about this. But first, are you subscribed? If you watched until here, then you must have enjoyed at least something about this video. So why not subscribe? It's fast, easy, and most of all, completely free. Subscribing helps shows us that you like these types of videos and shows us that we should continue with them. So you may as well. Now, let's get on to this. Gerald followed Dylan when he had around 30,000 followers on TikTok and requested his Snapchat. Dylan said. Subsequent to talking by means of Snapchat, Dylan welcomed Jerob to a Zoom call with his other TikTok companions. Ultimately, Jerob turned Dylan against his Zoom friends, persuading him that the entirety of Dylan's buddies made fun of him despite all of their friendship. Dylan, obviously a minor, as of now, trusted Jerob. When his best friends told Dylan about what was happening, Dylan said he was unable to accept their allegations that Bell was doing this. Yet ultimately, Dylan understood and blocked Gerald. Gerald then swiftly deleted all of his socials, like we're talking about now. And that is how we got to where we were. Gerald did some bad things and now he's paying for it. Another great thing is a new hashtag called hashtag cancel Gerald. But knowing from previous experiences, like David Dobrik and James Charles, I feel like Gerald will return and then he will say that nothing happened and everyone will love him again. And I guess all things that are good have to come to an end at some point. And now that we've discussed how Gerald got exposed, this is sadly going to mean that we have to end the video. But remember what I said before, if you've reached here and you have not subscribed, why not? Because clearly, you had to have liked at least one thing about this video. 
Also, make sure to leave a like because it helps us beat the YouTube algorithm and deliver the news to more people. And if you want to help us reach even more people, and we would really appreciate it if you did, all you gotta do is share this video with a few other people. And with that, I'm going to have to say goodbye. I'll see you guys in the next time.